Hi Girl Scouts, my name's Victoria and I am the STEM Program Manager at Girl Scouts of Citrus Council. Today, we're gonna start working on our Cadet Science of Happiness badge. Right now, with everything going on in the world, you might be finding yourself feeling a little bit more stressed out than normal. Life is looking a little bit different than it typically does, especially when it comes to school and this new term being thrown around called social distancing. While it is okay to feel a little bit more stressed out, it is also very important to take time to focus on what makes you happy and exercises that can bring you happiness. So I'm here to introduce a few tips and tricks of the science of happiness and for us to work on steps one and two of our badge. Step one, make yourself happier. One way to make yourself happier is by getting into a state of flow. When you hit your flow, you are really into whatever you are doing. You might be so focused that you do not even realize time flying by. For me, I get into my state of flow best when I do my workouts. I do these workouts from the comfort of my home and typically towards the end of the day when I am really needing to clear my mind from all my stress. Does working out get you into your state of flow? Maybe something else works for you. Maybe it's sports or baking or possibly reading a good book. Whatever it is that gets you into your flow, try doing it for 30 minutes each day for the next week. We're going to call this your me time. At the end of the week, let's see if you notice any difference in your level of happiness. Step two, think differently about happiness. So to think differently about happiness, we're going to focus on our strengths. When you focus on your strengths, you start to get a better understanding of yourself as a person and kind of learn how you function. You also start to seek opportunities rather than look at problems. So for this activity, you need a sheet of paper and some pens. And what we're going to do is think about three to five strengths about yourself and you're gonna write them down on a sheet of paper. Here are mine. So I wrote that I am kind, smart, confident, and funny. So in the next few months, when you encounter a difficult time or anything that you might think that your strengths can come in handy, you're gonna look at your sheet of paper and you're gonna figure out which one of those strengths you can use to help you get through that time. So for instance, one of mine is that I'm funny. Uh, so the way I can put that to use is maybe one of my friends or my family is feeling down um, because of everything that's going on. So I can help them goof off and have a good time and make them laugh and hopefully cheer them up. Did it work? No. Okay. We'll get them next time. Anyways, it is always so important to focus on your happiness, especially during times like this. While the activities in today's video might work for some people, they don't always work for everyone. This badge is all about the scientific process and about finding which practices work best for you. For more activities like this and to complete your Science of Happiness badge, make sure to tune in to next week's video when we complete steps three through five.